Anyways, what's up, everybody? Uh, Cardboard Moses, which you welcome. Uh, it is time to play. Uh, play. Well, yeah, we can play with a little 2018 Stadium Club Baseball four box break, uh, number nine eBay style. Let's do it to it. If I'm not mistaken, I ordered a case of Undisputed because I, you know, we did get some Undisputed last year, and we actually went through two cases of it. Fairly quickly, actually. So I did order some. I I don't even I never even heard of NT Wrestling. <laughs> Honestly, I think you're trolling me there, dude. Legs for days, still smoking. Oh my god, dude. I love Jr. Jr. had like the bet. Like he still he actually still announces. I don't know if you guys know this, but uh, for my wrestling fans, but Jr. still announces. He he um. He announces for New Japan, but it's not the JR that we know and love. It's a, it's like a mundane, like, you know, like, like, like it's still JR, but like you can tell he's like not the JR we're used to. He, he's a lot more calm. You know, he's not, oh my God, that man has a family. Oh my God. Oh my God. You know what I mean? Like he's, like he sent him straight to hell. Oh my God! That's one of my favorite calls. Is when Jr. used to be, we used to be like, uh, when he used to say things like, "That man has a family." <laughs> Dude, like you know it's fake, but like. They suspend the belief to the point where, like, it's so ridiculous, it's so entertaining, it's so awesome. I love wrestling. Wrestling is like the equivalent of women in soap operas. To, to, to put it in, in kind of perspective, like, why do you like wrestling? Well, do you watch Game of Thrones and, and, and bullshit like that? Well, instead of fucking fairies and dragons... You know, I got a dude called The Undertaker who's undead. And, you know, apparently he has powers. And I got his brother who's a demon, the red, the big red machine. You know, and he has like a little fire thing. You know, and then like, you know what I'm saying? I still watch like old pay-per-views. Like I actually saw that pay-per-view. You're talking about Dustin, uh, Undertaker and Mankind, where he, you know, choke slammed them through the through the cell. That wasn't supposed to happen. Like, Mankind almost died that day. Multiple times, actually. That dude is a legend. That, that's another dude whose theme song is pretty baller. And it starts off like it's a car crash or something. And then... Bah, 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 bah. What up, Scuba Steve? That shit's baller, too, man. And I like all his gimmicks. Dude Love, Cactus Jack. This is true, Dustin. This is true. That yes, What's up, uh, Nicholas? That's another thing that's always like... I know it's fake, but at the end of the day... What they're doing is real. Like, what they do is real. Like, there is no way that I suplex you from 10 feet above the ground and you're not going to feel that. Like, you're going to feel that. But, like, these dudes take some of the nastiest bumps, especially, like, Shane McMahon. Like, dude, Shane McMahon is not a wrestler at all. All and this dude is dropping bows from like 25 30 feet in the air, bro. And he misses like every time. <laughs> like, I can't for, like, I think it was the last, it was him, it was it was Kevin Owens and Shane McMahon. It, it was like, I think it was a Hell in a Cell match, and like, he did it again. And like, like, dude, like, I could feel like I was sick to my stomach watching it because I remember as a kid I remember you know Owen Hart passing away and stuff you know because of some bullshit or whatever you know what I mean so like I was like legit concerned I was like dude 
I've seen somebody die wrestling before. Like, I, I don't want to see Shane die again, taking this epic bump. But he does it time and again. Like, the, the ball's on the guy. Anyway, Anthony Santander hitting balls out the park. Rookie for the Orioles. Eddie Guerrero, RIP. That's my guy. Yo, he really does. Shane McMahon really does go from turnbuckle to turnbuckle. Uh, I think they call. I think he calls it coast to coast, with like a trash can in between. Remember when they used to do that? Like they don't do that anymore. Like they'll put like they, Shane used to put you know people on, in the bottom turnbuckle, just down there, and then they'll put like a freaking uh, trash can or something, an aluminum trash can on top, and then he like jump from one top rope to coast to coast. Sick. I'm at Rosario. Rookie black for the for for the Mets. Uh, Andrew Benintendi number to fifty for the Red Sox. Are you serious, Dustin? That's awesome, dude. I would have a blast, bro. Like, I grew up watching wrestling, man. Like, that's such an important part, like part of my childhood. Like, honestly. Like, I could have been out in the streets gangbanging, doing stupid shit. But instead, I would channel that through wrestling. And I, I would put my friends in the Cripper Crossphrase or the Walls of Jericho instead of, you know, doing stupid hood rat shit. I mean, I still do it a little bit, but, you know, whatever. Christian Villanueva, red rookie for the Padres. Dude, I used to hate John Bradshaw Layfield. I, I really liked him when he was part of the JBL gang. Him and, uh, what's his name, Ron Simmons. Damn! Good times. Uh, Dallas Keuchel. Orange for the Astros. Like, sometimes I'll, like, literally, my boy hooked me up with the WWE app or whatever. Like, the network thing. So, like, I literally, like, just watched, like, past shows and stuff. Back when they was still WWF. Hell yeah, I remember Gangrel. Gangrel still does like indie shows and stuff, man. That dude used to creep me the hell out with his vampire gimmick with Edge and Christian. So weird. To this day, I still get creeped out. Yeah, I know it's fake, but it still creeps me out. Uh, Dominic Smith, rookie, Mets. He's doing a show in two weeks. Where, where are you at, Dustin? Shawn Michaels is actually coming down in a couple weeks to Miami. Well, not Miami, but Fort Lauderdale uh, for this convention. I kind of want to go uh, to potentially get an autograph from that dude. Dwight Good in Mets, Red. Coming. Oh, he's in uh, Charleston, South Carolina. Dag. Yeah, I can't make that one. Dwight Good in Chrome for the uh, Mets. But yeah, JBL, John Bradshaw Layfield, I, I, I would much rather, I liked him when, when he was just getting drunk, you know, protecting people alongside Ron Simmons. Freddie Freeman, Brave Red. Dustin Turner, uh, Justin Turner, uh, red for the Dodgers. Kid named John Skyler, pretty good with the Indies. Part with the logo guys, does some work with WWE. Do you know the kid personally? Shohei Otani, rookie Angels, base. Hopefully that dude makes it, man. I mean, it doesn't have to be with WWE, man. There's a lot of promotions out there. Obviously, WWE, if you're trying to make money. But, you know, a lot of wrestlers are content with just being independent and just going from one promotion to the next and just travel the world. Uh, Dylan Peters, Marlins rookie. Austin Barnes, Dodgers auto. Uh, Carl, we are breaking stadium club. Four box break number... Nine for eBay right now.
This is the uh, last eBay break until midnight when we start back up again. Adam Jones Black Orioles. All right, that's the first box. What would be Cardboard Jesus' wrestler name? I think we got mine down, Pat, Money Moses. And I got I got his gimmick down, like, I'm Money Moses. What's Cardboard Jesus? Are we just going to call him the Jesus? And our tag team would be called the Disciples. I don't know if there's a tag team already with that name, but that's pretty dope. Call ourselves the Disciples. And I'm the flamboyant, you know, talking one, Money Moses. And then Jason is the, you know, the quiet, the complete opposite, quiet, intense, barely says anything, kind of on the, on the fringe of, you know, just spazzing out at any given moment. Shit, Billy Gunn. Badass Billy Gunn. Dude, the little house shows are probably in so so freaking cool. Cause I know in those house shows they probably go a little bit more like a little bit harder. As opposed to the WWE, you know, with their rules and regulations, man. That's a dope little show. Uh, yo, I would honestly not mind going to one of those shows at all. Like, that's right up my alley, dude. Like, I know I know. if you look at me like, oh, Uncle Jesse wouldn't be. Dude, I am a nerd. I am into, like, a wide variety of things. Like, I'm, in, I'm into hood rat shit, but I'm also into wrestling, dang it. And that, like, that show you're showing me right there, Dustin, like, I'm literally watching it right now. Like, that would be super cool to go to. You know, every now and then I'll go to, like, an anime. Like, I'm also into anime. So, every now and then I'll go to an anime convention if they ever come down. Uh, last one I went to, there was a wrestling event. Uh, and I think Sting was there. And uh, the Hurricane was there, too. And they wrestled. It was, it was pretty cool. And it was, like, a bunch of kids. And, and then there was, like, people more my age, too. And then there was, like, the grown-ups that were, like kids or like teenagers when wrestling was like popping uh, I don't know it was, it was cool man Max Kepler twins red even at a WWE show like it's and like everybody's the same more or less so like it just it gets it's a great time I love it it's so fun Ender Inciarte Braves red Anthony Rizzo Cubs Chrome See, he's shooting, he's doing a promo right now, but I can't, can't obviously hear him. Randy Johnson, red for the D-backs. Autograph for the Angels, Troy Scribner, rookie auto. And that is numbered to 50. They got the badass Billy Gunn. Cam Gallagher, Black Royals. Really, Dustin? Oh, man. It's sick. And, like, do they stick around and, like, talk to people and stuff? Can you, like, hang out with them and, like, maybe have a beer or something? That'd be so sick. 
Yo, Stone Cold, you want a beer? Obviously, Stone Cold probably won't be like at one of those events, but a boy could dream. Edwin Diaz, Red for the Mariners. Yo, that's honestly like on the bucket list, bro. Have a beer with Stone Cold Steve Austin, and they get stunnered right afterward. Greg Allen, rookie for the Indians. Otto. So Dustin, wait. So you you work with the wrestlers or something? Like, are you like own the pro you own your own promotion or something, dude? Alex Wood, Black Dodgers. Tyler Glass now red pirates. Hey, Kyle Ripken Jr. Red never compromise answer. Orioles. And Billy Gunn looks good, and I bet that dude's up there in age right now, man. Ah, that little dude's like, suck it. Ah, that's awesome. That's so sick. And he's, he's wearing a DX shirt? Of course. Got to. There's a meme. I don't know if you're familiar with memes, Dustin. But it's this thing on the internet where they'll like post a picture and they'll like have words around it, and sometimes they're funny. Uh, but anyway, uh, there's a meme. Oh, I lost my train of thought. Never mind. Anthony Santander, red for the Orioles. My memory is going. My brain's going to mush. I just forget stuff all the time. Stalin Castro, red Marlins. Uh, Chrome Byron Buxton for the Twins. I literally just completely lost that thought. I, I'm trying to look at the chat, trying to remember what I was gonna say. No idea. No idea. I don't know, Dustin. You lost me there. I don't watch baseball. <laughs> but I did see he had a pretty nasty catch. Like, oh, now I remember. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So memes. Okay. So you know about memes, right? Do you know about memes? Like you see a picture and then it's like it'll be a picture of some dude doing something or whatever. And then it'll have like words like to make it like funny. Right? So there's a meme of uh back to the meme right so I, I remembered i gotta lay off the weed anyways in this meme it's like oh you know you're you know current generations you know they they like to dab you know they'll you know what a dab is right i don't know if you have any young kids but it's it's stupid quite frankly but whatever you know i'm getting old so i no longer uh relate to the younger generation <laughs> anyways so in this meme it's like it's an instructional picture it's and it's like you it's like a little kid it's like a little yeah can't forget cam newton so it's a little kid it's like it's literally a picture it's one picture it's like he has his hands up like this and then it's like oh my generation's version of the dab went like this and it's the kid doing the suck it you know, like, suck it, the, the X over the genitals or whatever. And I thought it was, like, hilarious. Like, obviously, explaining it is not as funny. But, yeah, my man doing the, the, the D-Generation X maneuver. Suck it! Which was my generation's version of the dab. You know, kids nowadays go around dabbing. You know, I'll, I'll give you an example. Like, like, kids nowadays will be like, Dab, like, yeah, if you, if you watch football, Cam Newton, you know what I'm saying, like, oh, uh, dab, oh, I'm cool, dab, fuck that shit, my generation, yo, suck it, you can suck it, right, that's my generation, the difference between me and you is you dab and I crotch chop. This is the long this is taking a while for this match to start.
Back to the chat though, uh, Dustin. That's pretty cool, man. You know, a dude done it for 20 years. So if I decide, yo, I want to be a wrestler, can I go try out? Can you put the word in for me, Dustin? I mean, you 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 know me more or less. Like I seem like a charismatic dude when I feel like it, right? Old school championship wrestling, OSCW. Okay, I see like a thumbnail down there in the bottom. There, it looks like they're at a beach or something. That looks kind of cool. Oh, you know how to talk. <laughs> hey, I got the talking down pat. Like, I could be a manager for show. They should bring back the manager. Like, I could, I could easily do what, uh, what Paul Heyman does. It may be better. Brandon Woodruff, rookie for the Brewers. I could at least do what uh, Teddy Long used to do back in the day. Playa. That's my dude right there, Teddy Long. Listen here, playa. <laughs> Ah, uh, my I, I would want a gimmick similar to like the Million Dollar Man. Trevor Bauer, Black Indians. You know, just think he's better than everybody. You sound like Booker T. Booker T was cool. I didn't necessarily like that they were trying to turn him into the Rock when he came to the WWE, but whatever. Uh, Carlos Carrasco, red for the Indians. Uh, I mean, as far as my, like, voice, though, uh, I don't know if you can hear it or not, but yeah, I'm not exactly feeling good. But I'm champing through it. I'm champing through it. Herman Marquez, Rockies Orange. Jim Cornette. Why does that sound familiar? Isn't there that dude that, like, rates everything as far as, like, wrestling? Mr. Insert. I mean, as far as, like, variations and stuff like that are concerned, the only way to truly know is to look at the back of the card and look for the code. But my soldiers are trained for that, so I'll let them take care of that. Anything I miss, they'll, get, they'll go through it. Um, a red Carlos Gonzalez, Rockies. I think I'm gonna have to go to the dentist on Friday or something. Like I'm legit concerned about my tooth right now. Uh, Robbie Ray, Red D backs. Ichiro of the Mariners, Chrome. Okay, Richard, thank you, man. I mean, uh, oh, it's a surprise. I like surprises. As long as it's not like anthrax or something, you know. And this video is probably going to get flagged now by the FBI. That dude said anthrax. Keep an eye on him. Josh Reddick read for the Astros. You know, I've been, you know, I've also been contemplating maybe going, like, trying to be a stand-up comedian. Zach Davies, red for the Brewers. You know, see, this is base, code 31. I think it's code 67, that uh, variations and whatnot. Christian Yelich, Brewers, red. Harrison Bader of the Cardinals, rookie auto. That's a cool card, man. Pictures are really cool in these, uh, in this set. Dang it, now I, now I want to know what it is, Richard. Dang it. I don't like surprises. Especially when you tell me, like, oh, I got a surprise for you. Because then it's like, just tell me. But, like, I don't want you to tell me because I want to I be surprised. Austin Hayes, black, rookie, Orioles. I'm weird that way. I'm just a walking contradiction. I was going to say, Richard, dude, you're not going to say me nothing, bro. The fact that you 
give, well, not really give me your money, but the fact that you spend your money, you know, supporting me with the breaks, man, that's, that's honestly enough for me, man. And the fact that you come by and hang out, talk some shit with me, have a good time, five times out the week, all I can ask, man. But if you want to send me a gift, I mean, hey, I'm not going to say no to that, you know what I'm saying? I'm not going to say no to the free. I have been pretty hot this uh, this week. I ain't going to lie. I ain't going to lie. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, Ryan. I, I I do. I am interested for sure. <laughs> if only there were more like the two of you, Ryan and Richard. All right, last box, Mojo. Let's see what we got. Like a super fractor auto or something. Got a red uh, CC Sabathia Yankees. And Otani base rookie Angels. JT Re Almuto, red for the Marlins. Freaking hungry, man. Justin Schmoke. Red Blue Jays. Uh, Philip Evans, Mets rookie. Auto. Come on. I have Black Hunter Renfro. Padres. Yeah, I'm waiting to see a gold. But, like, this set is really nice, man. Especially, like you said, if you get a chrome card, a gold. The Super Fractor is really... I hit a Super Fractor already. Oddly enough, it was Byron Buxton of the Twins. Real nice stuff, man. Todd Frazier, Mets Red. Ryan, and listen, I, just, I do that because I would want to be... You know, I treat people the way... I would like to be treated. You know what I mean? So, oftentimes, I go above and beyond for people when they wouldn't do the same for me. But that's fine. 
I don't have, I don't have a problem with that. I am, I'm a firm believer in just being a good person, honestly. Or doing the best to be. Because at my core, I'm, I'm a degenerate. Uh, Dylan Maples, black rookie for the Cubs. Like, I'm a, I'm a really polite person. Like, you know, I say, yes, ma'am, no, sir. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? I, I, I'll hold the door open for you. You know, like, I'm, I'm polite. But, like, if you cross me, there's no limit to what I can or will do to you if you cross me. But if you're, like, in my good graces, oh, pff, nobody will treat you better than Uncle Jesse. Just don't cross me. Chris Archer, red for the Rays. Alright, last stack mojo. What do we got? Dude, this has been like one of the longest matches ever. Still watching Billy Gunn and uh, John Schuyler, Dustin. Uh, Jose Quintana, Cubs, red. Maybe like a one on one parallel in here or something. Mike uh, Mustaskis, red for the Royals. Bo Nose, Bo Jackson, chrome for the Royals. No cheese. The cheese would have been the the auto. What up, MJR? How you doing? Happy 4th of July, my dude. And that's going to do it for the break, my friends. All right. Recap time. Autos. What do we got? We have Cam Gallagher Royals, Philip Evans Mets, Harrison Barnes, I'm uh, sorry, Harrison Bader Cardinals, Brandon Woodruff Brewers, Greg Allen Indians, Troy Scribner Angels, Austin Barnes Dodgers, Anthony Santander for the Orioles. And that was the break, my friends. 2018 Stadium Club Baseball. Four box break number nine, eBay style. Thank you very much. We'll get it out to you.